Welcome to my project bazaar dot com. Our project title is Disease Prediction by Machine Learning over Big Data from Healthcare Communities. Let's be discuss about our abstract. Be discussing mining healthcare generation based predicting human disease in biomedical and healthcare communities. Accurate analysis of medical data benefits early disease detection, patient care, and community services. So we propose a novel methodology for disease prediction in different machine learning algorithms using find the user behaviors. So we streamline machine learning algorithm for effective prediction of chronic disease outbreaking disease frequent communities. So here we have to use training and testing data and each of uh, training data has we have to classify it into three types of classification algorithm like that navy bayes algorithm and k nearest neighbor algorithm and finally apply decision tree algorithm each and every algorithm present in the on the training data set and we have to calculate our accuracy if measured precision and recall result and then we propose a new conventional neural network based multimodal disease risk prediction as algorithm is used to unstructure and structure data from hospital details so in our testing data set have the better prediction with the help of cnn md rp algorithm to the best of our knowledge none of existing work focused on the both types in the area of medical big data analytics so finally finding the user behavior based on the given data set next we are going to discuss about our flow diagram so this is our flow diagram first of all we have to load our data set for our entire process uh, and uh, we have to load two types of data set one is training data set and another one is testing data set so first of all we have to load our uh, training data set which is called to s data set after loading the data set we have to uh, take our pre processing here we have to uh, el uh, delete our unwanted elements in the data set the next uh, the next process is map and reduce process here our data set will be uploaded on the hdfs uh, server after that it will be uh, map and reduce and it, it give the better results for the efficient efficient results then it going to the three types of classification will be made and one is navy based classification and another one is knn classification and decision tree classification in navy based classification we have to find out our probabilistic value and then uh, knn means we have to um, calculate our nucleus distance of the uh, data set and uh, finally we have to create our um, classic um, decision tree classification so three types of classification will completed after that we have to find our results in graphical manner so we have to find out our uh, accuracy and uh, recall uh, precision f measure we have to calculate it on the training data set after finishing the training data set we have to load our testing data set like that t and s data set so here we have to predict uh, predict prediction uh, with the help of cnn md or p algorithm so cnn is nothing but conventional neural network multimodal uh, disease risk prediction uh, on the testing data set so here we have uh, load our um, symptoms of uh, chronic disease like uh, whatever it may be uh, like uh, chronic diseases so we have to predict our uh, disease status and then we have to predict our cnn udrp unimodal uh, unimodal udrp uh, it, ha it it will be calculated successfully on the prediction and finally we have to uh, find out our result uh, on pre prediction uh, let's we see the demo of our project so this is our project we have to run on hadoop uh, eclipse software so just click alpha.java and right click run as run on hadoop our process will be run on open virtual machine so then click vmware and click finish button so this is prediction by machine learning over a big data from healthcare communities so this is the title of our project so just click on the images when i click browse permits we have to select our training data set first then click next the next process pre processing here we have to neglect our unwanted elements in the data set so click pre process so pre process successfully completed then click next button so after uh, finishing the pre processing then we have to load our data set into the database so inside our database so 
we have to display our data set which is stored on the database so click after uh, inserting the database then we have to upload a file on HDFS server which hand which take the output like a word count so our file will be uploaded successfully so this is our output okay then we have to load our data set into HDFS server then click next so in our training data set have three classification algorithm first one is navy based classification so first of all we have to calculate our overall result of the data set and we have to find out our navy based classification which is calculated successfully here we have to find out the probabilistics of the data set and click next button so next we have to apply the KNN classification here find out the nucleus distance of the each vectors so find the k distance so here we have to find out our k distance value so when I click ID based KNN so each and every ID have the specific k distance the next we have to show our decision tree classification so in decision tree class classification so each and every BMI has the important value and its count is shown on here so this is DT2 value and this is DT3 value so our D3 uh, will be calculated successfully our decision tree classification is successfully done here so when I click graph so this is the classification comparison result between Navy Briggs classification and KNN classification and decision tree classification each and every classification have the specific result about the accuracy recall and F measure and then precision so next we have to run our uh, testing data set okay just click te testing da data set and run on Hadoop so select our VM virtual machine and click finish so click browse button here we have to take out our testing data set then we have to calculate our support vector so here we have to select our symptoms about the chronic disease so each and every chronic have the specific count so the next we have to find out our prediction so uh, in this prediction have the result about the diseases so next we have to calculate our symptoms and then predict our high risk patients so our high risk patients and their RPC level and their related records and overall records should be calculated successfully and click next testing button so in case one of the user will become if the user is uh, old user means they are give their name and password and go to the login uh, so if, if the user is new user means click here so just we have to click here so the patient name is Taj so select their the user ID is 13 so I will give name an ID and password confirm password so register so the patient will register successfully okay then give the username and give the password click login so the name and user ID and manager everything was calculated successfully so uh, use, uh, the patient will enter there the white plus will count so 12 right plus each and everything whatever it may be it should calculate it successfully okay 4 plated cell 5 so select so we have to encrypt our data set and we have to send these results into the healthcare system so we have to go and run our healthcare system okay So click on Hadoop. So just wait for our result.
also select our user ID so 13 is the user ID so we have to get our results and here we have to predict our UDRP result so our condition is bad condition so bad condition so this is the final graph so this is the prediction results for CNN UDRP and CNN MDRP results so each and every prediction have the uh, specific value like accuracy and recall, F measure and precision. So demo is completed. Thank you for watching this video.